Okay. I think now it's just a sniper. In theory. Unless there's more in the building with the sniper. But it seems like he sent out his guys. So maybe? curious because I hear dogs and it seems weird. I definitely think it's just him up here now. He's not talking shit so I can't see him. Which is a good kind of weakness to this, hey, you can see where your enemies are. Which is, hey, they're not making a sound, you actually can't see them for shit. Cutscene. That's brutal. Oh fuck. Ah, uh, I love fun sniper rifle sections. Dude. Come on, guys. Oh, where? Oh, in there. Nice that they. Them shooting at other guys helps me figure out where the fuck they are. Oh, there. Oh, I saw Ellie shooting over there. Bye, dude. Bye. Over there? Okay, another dude over there. Oh. Where? Fuck.
fuck you assholes and your goddamn Humvee oh, that was intense you all right Sam yeah I'm okay thanks Joel nice I'm still in sniper rifle mode Look at this. Oh, all right we did it we should move all right Sam Henry! Sam, are you okay? Yeah, yeah, I'm fine. You sure? I said I'm fine. Come on, come on! Let's move! Oh, God. One shot, everything. I love it. Wish I could take it with me. Yeah. Too many. Time to run. You're okay. I'm still here. Anybody hurt? Uh -oh. No, we're good. I think it's time we quit this place. Yeah. Come on. Let's go. Hell out of Dodge. <laughs> Shut the hell up. That's serious. It's Tommy's birthday, and that's all he wanted to do is just rent two Harleys and drive cross country. I could die happy if I could just ride one around the block. <laughs> <laughs> what was it like? It was good. It was real good. Good? Can, can you believe this guy? Come on, man. Give me details. Describe it. <laughs> you know what? You two deserve a little privacy. No, no, Ellie, Ellie. This isn't just any regular motorcycle, okay? You get on that bad boy, you feel that engine? Nothing like it. I don't think Ellie's oh, yeah. How understood you know? any engine. I've seen it in my dream. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I don't think anyone from my group is gonna show up. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Worst part about it all, explaining to Sam. Well, it's safe to say those two have officially bonded. Yeah, after I What are you doing? Trying to decide to leave. Taking stock of all the food we found today. I see. And how are we doing on canned peaches? Did Henry send you? No. Why would Henry send me? To make sure I'm not fucking up somehow. Mm. I'd say we all did pretty good back there. Especially you. Is everything all right? Yeah, everything's fine. Mm. Okay. Well, have a good night. His brother's overprotective, and it makes him feel like everything he's doing is wrong. Who says that I'm not? What are you scared of? <sighs> Let's see. Scorpions are pretty creepy. Mm. Uh, being by myself. I'm scared of ending up alone. What about you? Those things out there. Nah. What if the people are still inside? What if they're trapped in there without any control of their body? That's a philosophical question. Scared of that happening to me. Okay. 
First of all, we're a team now. Okay, we're gonna help each other out. And second... They might still look like people, but that person is not in there anymore. Henry says that they've moved on. That they're with their families. Like in heaven. Do you think that's true? I go back and forth. I mean, I'd like to believe it. But you don't. I guess not. It's hard to believe what you don't see in... Me neither. Oh. All the serious talk. I almost forgot. Yep. There. Ellie did take it. know about it. Can't take it away. All right. I'm I knew it showed up later. I just didn't remember who took it. That's why I was looking to see if I could see her take it. Hmm. Oh, God damn it. That smells good. Good morning. Where's Sam? I'll let him sleep in for once. Oh. Well, if you want him to join us, you can go wake his ass up. Okay. Sam? <laughs> Sam! What the hell? <laughs> Shit, he's turning! <laughs> That's my fucking brother! <laughs> Screw it! Go in. Gotta go real right. Uh -huh. Oh my god. Sam? Oh no. Sam? Henry? <gasps> Ellie, stay there. Henry? What have you done? I'm gonna get that gun from me, okay? Oh, okay, okay, easy. Is it your fault? This is nobody's fault, Henry. It's all your fault! Henry! Henry, no! Oh my god. That's still rough. And I was trying to stay quiet because I knew it was going to happen. But that's still rough. Jackson County. Uh, I'm tearing up city, a little bit. Right? Show me more than a few miles. You ready to see dear old brother? I'm just ready to get there. You nervous? I don't know what I'm feeling. Hmm. Not just the fact that it is... Two people you bonded with, but also knowing that you understand that Henry's overprotective of his brother, and it's because he loves him, and to prevent that reality from happening. But God damn! Not only does he have to kill his brother, but he also can't go on in the world without his brother, because that was his main motivation for survival I would think would be keeping his brother alive of protecting his brother that was his focus that was his goal almost and he failed it and so he what happened between you two and him. what do you mean you and Tommy you're not together, so clearly something went wrong. We just had a bit of a disagreement. Nee. Ah, here we go. So what was it about? Tommy saw the world one way, I saw it the other. And <laughs> that's why he joined the Fireflies. <laughs> yeah, your friend Marlene promised him hope. That kept him busy for a while, but just like Tommy, he eventually quit that too. How was it the last time you saw him? I believe his last words to me were, I don't ever want to see your goddamn face again. <laughs> He's gonna help us? 
I suppose we're gonna find out. Well, if they're without his help, we'll get there. Let's just keep going. Ellie's just remarkably positive. And I guess it's sort of even that conversation she had with Sam of he asked her and she afraid and she said yeah. But she doesn't act it because Really not going to change much. I'm a hydro who. It uh, it uses the river's movement and uh, turns it into electricity. Let's do that. Look, I know what it is. I don't know how it does it. All right. How are we getting across? There you go. There you go. Ooh, that's a lot of stuff. Okay. Uh, spin this around. Create a bit of a bridge. Well, that gets us halfway. If we get the other one up, we'll make it across. And time to find a floaty thing. Go swimming. Uh, anything else under here? Besides? Eh, I don't see any other thing down here. So, go down. I remember this was this time, last time I played it, couldn't remember for anything. Mm, pretty sure I nearly drowned trying to find it. The clue though was the caution tape. Which I honestly do feel like there was something else underneath here, but I am not gonna risk trying to go find it. Okay. I need you to Oh, I know. I'm a fucking pallet. Over this way. Oh, goddammit. Can we turn around? I can fucking see. Spin it. Oh, give it a spin. Because you can pull Joel up. Hell of a swim back up. Teamwork. Cute. Anything down here? Yep. But I'm full on most of it. So do that. And there we go. Anything else down here? That's too small. Oh god. Leave that stupid robot on his grave. What should I do with it? I mean, what? I want to talk about it. No. Why not? How many times do we need to go over this? Things happen. We It's just. That's enough. You're right. I'm sorry. Let's get the Tommies. Mm. Green it. That's not healthy either. The whole repression of 
of don't talk about it because it feels bad to talk about it. But just because it feels bad doesn't mean it's not worth talking about. I know I am too. Let's get past this place, then we can scrounge up some food. Literally, Ellie, do not shoot a squirrel. For a few reasons, but mainly just because I don't want to draw infected. Uh, ain't no way around. Gonna have to cut through the plant. I'll take this plant. Oh yeah. Killing speed, listening mode I upgraded first. Now got some better health. Extra pit. Which I have, I think not died much better this time around. Nice map. Uh, I think I'm full on most crafting things. Can make another one of these. But yeah, that's basically full now. Can't pick up any more explosive. I can, however, pick up a new gun. El Diablo. I remember this being super powerful, but also one shot is not great. Don't even think about reaching for your weapon. Tell the girl to drop hers now. Ellie? It was the lady says. Yeah. Hey. Please tell me you're lost. Oh, we didn't know the place was occupied. We're just trying to make our way through. Through to where? They're all right. But you know these people? I know him. He's my goddamn brother. Tommy. Holy shit. <laughs> How you doing, baby brother? <laughs> Damn. Let me look at you. You're fucking old. <laughs> Easy. Won't happen to you, too. This is Maria. Be nice to her. She sort of runs things around here. Ma'am, thanks for not blowing my head off. Would have been embarrassing, considering you're my brother-in-law. Yeah. We all got to get wrangled up at some point. Ellie, right? Yeah. What brings you through here? Uh... It's a long... It's kind of a long story. Yeah. Why don't we bring him inside? Yeah. You hungry? I'm starving. been dealing with raids. A lot of bandits in this area. It's been quiet for a few days. What the hell are you doing here? I thought I'd find you in Jackson. Been trying to bring the plant back to life. We had it working before, but one of the turbines went south. We have electricity, Joel. I had. We'll get it running again. No way. You guys have horses. We got a whole lot of them. Hey, Tommy, give me a hand with this. Sorry, I'll be right back. Can I? Yeah, of course. He likes when you cut his ears. You ever ride one? I actually have. When? <laughs> when have you ridden a horse? Uh, Winston, this soldier back in the zone, he gave me lessons. You know, if you want, we can take him riding later. That'd be awesome. There. Hey, thanks, Tommy. No sweat. All right, let's continue the tour. Ah. <sighs> Yeah? Why are you here? Weren't you supposed to head back this morning? Still waiting on Hauser and the rest of the boys to relieve me. You know, we'll be fine. Just go home to your family. It's just a couple more hours. I'll tough it out. All right. Look, take it easy. What's up? Yeah, 
go ahead. We're in the control room. Steve's about to start it back up. You want to come check it out? <sighs> I'd rather eat with Ellie. It's my turn anyway. I'll go. I'll come with you. Go with Maria. Get some food. In. Joel. Come on, Ellie. Let's give the boys some space. Yeah, let brothers catch up. You I'm go have a meal. It's by. fine. This will be the sixth time of them trying to get the turbines back online. We've been here just a week. It feels like forever. Why is this room full with they sky covered? Uh, I got something for you. Last year I went back to Texas. Back home. Most of our stuff is long gone. Most of it. Here. It's a little faded, but it still looks pretty good. I'm good. You sure? I mean, I said I'm good. I don't even think he fully looked at it. Okay. I'll hold on to it for you. Tell me, I, I need to talk to you privately. Yeah. Okay. Let me just check on my guys real quick. Come on. I'm just gonna head over here real quick because I don't think I've ever done this. Probably haven't because I just followed Tommy without scrounging his area for supplies. I don't know what you heard, but you should see the town. We're over 20 families strong now. It was Maria and her father. They set up this place with the idea of being self-sustained. We had crops and livestock. Remember how we thought no one could live like this anymore? We're doing it. What do you do for protection? The adults take turns guarding the perimeter. We even got an electrified fence when we plant it. Nice. You still got to deal with infected, though, right? Who doesn't? But it's the world we live in. Or maybe you don't have to be. <laughs> you sound like Marlene. Yeah. <laughs> Currently, he's on the way to potentially deliver a possible cure, <laughs> which is these two geniuses are gonna bring this plant back to life. We think we got it this time. <laughs> on that, on no, that, us. take these pills. I'll bet you a million bucks it works. Take sure. this. Book to upgrade the smoke bombs. Oh, looky here. I'm kind of ignoring them, but hey. Uh, reload speed, considering you can only hold one at a time. Uh, let's see. Cliff capacity wouldn't be bad, but it's less times I have to reload, the better. Recoil. Um, can't upgrade that yet. Range. Reload speed. That should be good. To the left. Watch it. Okay, that's good. Lower it. Slowly. All right. That's good. Tommy's here. We good to go?
pretty impressive. Looks like you're out two million bucks. <laughs> All right, Joe. Let's go talk. It's quite the crew you got here. <laughs> They're good men. This place gives them a second chance. Give us all a second chance. So why'd you leave Boston? I've been on quite the adventure, little brother. Yep. I reckon he's got something to do with that girl. He's got everything to do with that little girl. Well, go on then. She's immune. Immune to what? Oh, See, come on. I know I've seen her breathe enough spores to take down a dozen men. Nothing. Now, I wouldn't have believed it neither. But I can show you. All right. I'll bite. Why bring her here? I'm supposed to deliver to the fireflies. The way I figure they're your boys. You finish the job, you collect the whole damn thing. I haven't seen a firefly in years. You know where they are. Mm-hmm. I'm not asking for much, Tom. I just want some simple gear, enough to set me on my way. What makes you think I'd do this for you? This isn't for me, Tommy. This is for your damn cause. My cause is my family now. You ain't talking about some walk in the park here. Jesus, boy. Have Maria get some of your born-again friends to do it. They got I... families, too. Tommy, I need this. You want some gear? Sure. But I ain't taking that girl off your hands. This is how you gonna repay me, huh? Repay you? For all those goddamn years I took care of us. Took care? That's what you call it? I got nothing but nightmares from those years. You survived because of me! It wasn't worth it. I bring you the cure for mankind, and you wanna play the pissy little brother? We ain't back in Boston. You lay your hands on me again, it won't end well for you. The hell is that? We're under attack. You still remember how to kill, right? Their relationship is such a juxtaposition to the players we were just with.